that we're going to play. Um, some of you may know the tune National Emblem March by uh, E.E. Bagley. Um, and if you don't, uh, sorry, don't feel the need to stand up again at the beginning of the march. Um, so you'll recognize right away the uh, tune that uh, is the melody at the beginning of the piece. And there's a uh, distinct difference in the melody as you get to the top of the melody. So see if you can hear that. Uh, it's, a, it's a one note difference that, that changes it. So I won't give it away, but it's a uh, very well known march. And kind of the interesting thing about it is a lot of people assume it's a John Cole to the march. And this is, and even though it sounds very much like a John Cole to the march, there's some key differences. Um, but it's not, and it's almost always, um, it's almost always confused by people that it's a Susan March. So, uh, one of the things that's a little interesting is uh, when we get to the trio, the instruments that uh, Mr. Bagley features in the march are atypical of what you would hear in, typ in a typical Susan March. So in Susan March, you typically think that the melody is going to be in the trumpets and the high brass, and it's pretty much going to live there the whole time. And in this piece, it's a favorite of the low brass players because they actually do it uh, quite often. So we hope you enjoy the National Animal March. 